my name is Laura McGuire and I'm the director of the Regional Manufacturing Technology Center. The Regional Manufacturing Technology Center is often referred to as the RMTC. At the RMTC, we offer a number of industrial trades training programs, including industrial, electricity and electronics, heating, ventilation, air conditioning and refrigeration, instrumentation, industrial technology, machining technology, pipe fitting, tool and die, and welding. At the RMTC, all of the training is offered in a non-traditional format. What that means is our programs are open entry, open exit, modularized, competency-based, and instructor facilitated. Hi, I'm Kevin Barnes. I'm the instructor for the Industrial Electricity Electronics Program here at Kellogg Community College out here at the RMTC. The primary focus of this program is to train individuals that are going to be going into the electrical field, whether it be out into the construction areas of the electrical field or the industrial areas. The program is designed to start somebody with virtually no experience already in the electrical field take them from the, the baby steps right up through to be a competent electrician or a competent technician to, to handle industrial facilities. Right now the, the entire electrical industry we're seeing a lot of a lot of growth in it. We're, what we're seeing is a lot of the a lot of the tradesmen now are getting to the point where they're ready to retire, they're starting to think about, it, they're starting to retire and that's starting to leave a lot of openings where actually we get a lot of call for uh, industrial electricians, people that want to get out into the field working. Um, there's some really good opportunities out there right now. My name is Shane Bresson. I'm the HVAC instructor here at Kellogg Community College. Um, our program covers everything from um, high efficiency furnaces to 80% furnaces to refrigeration for your common cooler to your supermarket cooler to your industrial uh, refrigeration system. Uh, the HVAC um, background is a little bit of jack of all. Um, as far as trades go, we get a little bit of instrumentation, electrical, uh, refrigeration, heating, uh, and some pipe fitting all in one shot. So we're a little bit different than most trades because we have to use a little bit of everything, I guess. Our job growth rate is really good. Uh, between now and 2020, we're looking at a 36% job growth rate. So the outlook for jobs is, is pretty good with a median average salary somewhere around $54,000, $55,000 a year. Um, so there's a lot of earning potential with that being the median salary and uh, a lot of job growth also. My name is Bob Griffin. I'm the industrial technology instructor here at the RMTC. Yeah, in the, especially in Michigan, in the, in the Battle Creek area especially, it seems that manufacturing has really taken off. Uh, we're getting calls quite often for, almost daily, for people that uh, companies are looking for. They can't find qualified people that have the right skills and, uh, and have the right work aptitude. Uh, in Michigan, the, the job market hasn't in the past been so good, but it's really picked up in the last year or two, I would say. And in the robotics industry, um, if you, it, especially if you know some PLC, some uh, programmable logic controller uh, uh, skills, if you have that, those skills, uh, there's a big demand for automation. I'm Tom Longman. I'm the machining instructor here at Kellogg Community College. Uh, we teach students how to work with machinery, uh, become machinists, tool and die makers, uh, mold makers, uh, CNC programmers. Uh, the students learn the, the skills they would need to be successful in a machining environment, uh, such as blueprint reading, math, um, how to use measuring tools. They um, 
eventually, later in their uh, training programs, they learn how to program machinery, uh, CNC machinery specifically. Uh, they learn to uh, operate uh, CAD CAM software. Uh, right now, due to uh, what we went through recently with the recession, uh, there were very few people entering into manufacturing and skilled trades. Um, now that is gone and things have really picked up, we have uh, tremendous opportunities for students uh, to work into these careers that are that are expanding and booming. Companies are hiring, looking for people, so it's a great opportunity for young people to uh, get into a career that's really exciting and um, challenging for them. I'm Rob Cahoon. I'm an instructor at the HVAC pipe fitting here at the RMTC. And uh, today we're going to demonstrate the pipe threader. Our technical trades out here give you the information and the, the knowledge base and the hands-on tools that you need to enter the workforce, enter the job, and utilize those skills to basically give you uh, a higher level knowledge instead of an entry level knowledge. Hi, I'm Doug Adams. I'm the welding instructor here at Kellogg Community College. The program is primarily all hands-on. Essentially, probably 98% of the program uh, is you're actually in the lab welding. Uh, the, the remainder of the program is theory based on the processes that are being taught. Okay, what sets KCC apart from a lot of the welding programs, or actually trade programs in general, is the open entry, open exit type of format that we have here at KCC where students aren't required to wait until the beginning of a semester to get started. They can actually come in at any time during the school year and figure out a curriculum, what they want to take to meet their needs. And once the curriculum is established, then the students can come in and actually start work on it actually the same day. With a growing number of retirements in industrial trades occupations today, along with the emergence of new technologies, a lot of industries are struggling with finding qualified workers and keeping the workers they have. So here at the RMTC, what we've been trying to do is recruit more youth into the manufacturing industry and working in positions like this. We do a lot of work with the Branch Area Career Center and the Calhoun Area Career Center, which are two vocational schools within our areas. Any individuals taking classes at those two centers may articulate that credit here into the college. Hi, I'm Rob Cahoon. I am a team mentor coach out here at the KCC RMTC for the Bruin Box. I am also an instructor out here for the HVAC and pipe fitting department. Well, the Broombots is a competition team, um, also a robotics program that we started out here at the RMTC to um, give kids an idea and to STEM, which is science, technology, engineering, math, uh, to help support them in their endeavors for that, um, which also ties into what we do out here in the manufacturing process for the KCC RMTC. We hit ages pretty much 10 through 14, uh, or grades 5th through 9th. Um, and that allows them to uh, learn about the manufacturing process, the design process, and gives them the opportunity to tie in all their science learning into one big package. The RMTC is actively involved in supporting the Manufacturing Consortium for Berry Branch in Calhoun Counties. One of the focuses of the consortium is improving the image of manufacturing. Over the years, the media has been filled with stories of plant closing, mass layoffs, outsourcing, but right now in our community, the opposite is true. We have a number of companies who are struggling to find qualified workers to fill their jobs. 
qualifications include a higher level skill set where students are required to know computers and be familiar with computers. Students need strong problem solving and critical thinking skills. They need a higher level of math and English. All of that comes together, especially in the industrial trades, when you're looking at the level and the type of technology that's used in the industrial trades programs.